Hello, and welcome to Crazy Talk Tutorials. Creating natural eyes and teeth. Creating a natural looking set of eyes and teeth is simple to do with the new Crazy Talk 5.0. Using the default attribute sliders to edit and customize the look of the preset templates is still a quick and easy option. But now you can also import your own images directly into the eye and mouth positions on your Crazy Talk model. In this tutorial, we will become familiar with the advanced facial setting menu and setting calibration once you are pleased with the new eyes and teeth. So let's go ahead and get started now. Open Crazy Talk 5.0 and then play the default script. Notice that the image retains its original eyes and has no teeth. Then click the Advanced Facial Settings button to launch the menu screen. Once the menu is launched, then make sure the Eyes tab is selected and begin to adjust the eye settings. There are many different templates to choose from, and they all can be edited individually, from natural to very stylized, even animal, and cartoon. Select a natural blue eye, and then with the pupils bullet checked, move the saturation slider forward. Notice that the pupils are now a cool blue. Select the whites bullet, and adjust the brightness to match the natural look of the image. Or click Keep Original Eyes to keep the original eyes from your image. You can see the difference very easily by clicking on and off. To edit the teeth templates, you need to select the Teeth tab and then choose a template. Adjust the scale of the template by using the dense sparse slider to widen the teeth and the short tall slider to lengthen them. You can also displace them as well. Then use the brightness slider to match the overall lighting and tone of the image for a more natural look and feel. Select OK to apply. Using custom images that you've created is easy to import and apply as well. To do this we will switch to another model. In this case we will use the doll from the human folder. Return to the advanced facial settings menu and then again select the eye tab or teeth depending on which feature you wish to edit and locate the import button. Click import and then browse to your custom images. The dimensions for your custom images should be 128 pixels by 128 pixels for the eyes and for the teeth they should be 256 pixels by 256 pixels. Once they're imported you can then adjust them to fit our model properly by using the size and displacement arrows. You can do the same for the teeth template by simply going to the teeth tab and then clicking the import button once again. Navigate to your custom image and then if you wish choose to edit them with the sliders and the displacement arrows as well. Once you're happy with the placement of the teeth, select OK to apply. Now, click the calibration arrow from the top toolbar and select eyeball movement to view your eye fitting and range of movement. Then, again, click the calibration arrow from the top toolbar and select mouth shape and view your mouth fitting and the range of vowel sounds. To show you the difference between our original image without eyes and teeth versus the difference between after natural eyes and teeth have been added to our avatar. Crazy Talk 5.0 makes it easy to create eyes and teeth for any avatar you wish to use. Having the ability to import custom images allows users to explore any number of model styles and looks enhancing the realism of all of your characters in just a few clicks. Crazy Talk 5.0's advanced facial settings makes the process simple and fun. If you have any further questions, please feel free to visit www.reillusion.com or contact technical support.